Hi everybody, we will uh, now prove work energy theorem for a variable force, work energy theorem in the case of a variable force, in the case of variable force, in the case of variable force. Okay, what is work energy theorem? It states that <coughs> the change in kinetic energy, the change in kinetic energy of a particle, the change in kinetic energy of a particle, the change in kinetic energy of a particle is equal to the is equal to the work done on it work done on it by the net force work done on it by the net force okay to derive this equation let me <coughs> consider the equation of uh, uh, kinetic energy so kinetic energy is uh, given by half mv square kinetic energy is equal to half mv square let me differentiate this equation with respect to time then what i get <coughs> rate of change of kinetic energy so dk by dt is equal to <coughs> differentiation of differentiation of half mv square because i need change in kinetic energy now that is why i will uh, differentiate this because dk stands for very very small change in kinetic energy so on simplifying this what happens dk by dt dk by dt will be equal to half m is a constant half m into so differentiation of v square differentiation of v square differentiation of v square is okay 2e into dv by dt differentiation of v square is 2e into dv by dt so what happens this uh, 2 and 2 gets cancelled and dv by dt will be equal to acceleration so therefore i can write so dk by dt dk by dt is equal to m into a into v i can write this okay uh, this will be equal to this will be equal to m into a is equal to force force v i'll write it as dx by dt okay v means rate of change of displacement i'll write it as dx by dt so what happens this dt and this dt gets cancelled <coughs> dk that very very small change in kinetic energy will be equal to f dx we will get this okay now uh, <coughs> let us suppose that uh, the displacement changes from say the position changes from xi to xi to xf okay so corresponding kinetic energy it will be ki to kf kinetic energy will change from ki to kf so integrating so what happens when the so integrating on both side integration of f dx between the limits xi and xf between the limits xi and xf is equal to integration of dk between the limits ki and kf okay so what is integration of dk integration of dk will be equal to k okay between the limits ki and kf so that is equal to so what is this term okay the integral of the definite integral of force over displacement okay is equal to work done so we have we already know that definite integral of force over displacement is equal to work done so that will be equal to work done i can write it directly okay so this is equal to work done work done okay so therefore the final step first you apply the upper limit in the place of k you write final kinetic energy minus initial kinetic energy is equal to work done so hence we have proved work energy theorem for a variable force thank you very much